A Distributed Control System, or DCS, is a computerized system that automates industrial equipment used in continuous processes as well as batch processes while reducing risk to people and the environment. The DCS is considered to be the central nervous system and brain as it safely controls, automates, and coordinates every aspect of production to help optimize productivity and ensure quality. Distributed control systems are used in the chemical industry to safely convert raw materials into finished goods used directly by consumers or to make materials needed in other industrial processes. DCS systems are also involved in all aspects of mining operations, such as extraction, transportation, and processing. In fact, distributed control systems can be found pretty much anywhere there is a critical process to be monitored or controlled, including processes that help energy transformation initiatives and preserve natural resources. Distributed control systems remotely automate the way that industrial equipment like motors, valves, and pumps operate, so everything runs safely and efficiently. A DCS uses industrial-grade computers called process controllers. These controllers are functionally or physically distributed to oversee and control the various parts of a process, typically called units. This is what the distributed in DCS refers to. And process controllers need to run 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and are typically installed with redundancy to ensure their continued operation. Process controllers all talk to one another to supervise, coordinate, and orchestrate the different process areas together to ensure the right product with the right quantity is produced as efficiently and safely as possible. In an industrial process, you will find input devices such as transmitters and sensors, which are used to measure temperature, level, pressure, and flow rates of material. You will also find output devices such as actuators and drives, which take action to control and regulate various equipment such as pumps, motors, and valves. The process controllers use input and output modules or in some cases more modern field bus networks to communicate with equipment and devices that are distributed throughout the plant. These items are part of what we call a control loop. For example, the pressure in a tank is measured and the data is sent to the controller. If the pressure is too high, it will trigger the valve to open further to reduce the pressure. You can find thousands of control loops in one single plant. While the goal is to automate as much as possible, the process controllers provide real-time information to plant operators and other staff through computer workstations, or HMIs, which are typically located in a control room. And in some cases, the control rooms are located remotely, far away from the actual process, allowing plant operators to monitor from a safe distance and intervene if necessary. ABB Distributed Control Systems empowers industries to make a world of difference, helping them to keep their processes running and provide us with things we use in everyday life. ABB is a global company with industrial automation personnel around the world in over 100 countries. ABB has consistently led the global DCS market for over two decades and an even longer history of developing and installing control systems. ABB Process Automation making a world of difference.